Bobby Kotick left. That's a good sign. He literally left. Phil Spencer is in charge. He'll make Call of Duty great again. Um, people will be like, no, Microsoft won't make great again. Well, Phil Spencer, you know what I mean? He's big time involved making good stuff. Um, he's the big boss now. Activision now. He's the big man. Um, he will be like, well, look at Halo uh, Infinite, you know, it has skill based matchmaking, they ain't doing things with it. It's not a Microsoft thing, not a Microsoft issue, it's a 3 for 3 issue. And the type of devs they have, they ain't listen to the community, they're brain dead. They, they play the victim card and say, all gamers are all toxic. And I'm like, dude, you, you never had, went into a Call of Duty lobby and get cussed out all to hell, you know what I mean? I mean like, the, those devs over there in 343 wouldn't handle a old school lobby, a Halo 3 LAN lobby, or original MW2 lobby. They couldn't even handle that, because they could just get triggered like a SJW, Snowflake, uh, weirdo. But yeah, um, it's a 343 issue. But when it comes to Call of Duty, Phil Spencer, yeah, uh, Call of Duty will always get bought. A lot of people will always buy it. It's the way it is, how it is in the you know community of Call of Duty, anywhere else, Battlefield, wherever. Um, yeah, Phil Spencer will make it great again. Like Donald Trump, hell yeah. Like Elon Musk, hell yeah. Alex Jones is always right, always. Hell yeah. I like repeat myself. Repeat myself. Oh yes. But yeah. Looking forward to the new Black Ops game. That's just me and my opinions and and I'm and the words going around that the zombies will have a round based zombies. That's gonna be awesome. From the new Black Ops series. Um yeah, and then Microsoft is going to be involved deeply with Call of Duty. Hopefully Call of Duty will be just military factions and nothing too uh, weird, furries, and anime bullcrap stuff. I want to play the game, be part of a faction, and play as that faction. Hell, if the faction had operators, I don't want the operators to have like, weird anime bundle skins. Hopefully Microsoft will... Who knows, maybe fix that situation and no weird uh, weapons that makes you disappear when you get shot. No those weird funky bundles. Hell, I would buy a, a real military faction bundle. Look apart from enemy and then the friendlies. Um, hopefully. So yeah, Phil Spencer. The big man is in charge. He knows what the hell he's doing. So, after New Year's, he might change some things around. He's still involved. He's still the big boss now, after Bobby Kotick left. Bobby Kotick is a, a disgusting, corrupt moron. Uh, a very, very bad dude. Way worse and bad. Kind of crooked like the Mafia or something like that. Like the government, maybe. Maybe. Um, who knows? So yeah, that's the video. It's a balls to the wall level. Bill Spencer is the man. He'll get things done. And he did the little uh, message of the thing uh, to the people that's working in, on Call of Duty. It's like, it's all normal, but some things will change uh, after New Year's. I don't... I don't know the full message thing, what he said to everybody, but yeah, it's cool. Yeah, that's the video and stuff. Pretty exciting. Looking forward to the new Black Ops game. It's gonna be fun. Hopefully, camo grinding will be fun. So yeah. Anyways, yes, all in out. Oh, my beloved daughter Daya. Hold on a little longer. Your mom will save you no matter what.